Hi guys, my name is Yvonne Uchi and welcome to my first ever YouTube video. It's been a long time for me and everybody that knows me knows that I want to start YouTube for. I mean, something just keeps happening and I never do, but I'm here now. So, based from the title of the video, you guys already know I went to Ghana for the first time and I had a pretty awesome time and I did vlog it, but I'm not gonna talk about my vlogging skill right now because, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to give you guys to raise my vlogging skill. Let me know it's my first time, so don't be too hard on me, you know. Before we get right straight into the video, don't forget to please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you do enjoy it, and don't forget to share it to a friend another friend, a family member. So no long talk and let's get straight into the video. That's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Yeah, that's me. So I had my friend help me out with my yellow fever card, but getting to the airport in Ghana, I found that it was invalid or fake. So I actually had to get another one in Ghana, and that made me taking a shot. So <laughs> that's the story behind that. p.m. I feel like I'm whispering but everywhere is quiet and I'm, I feel like I don't want to shout. I just want to do it like a quick room door for you guys so you guys can see where I don't know if you guys get but I'm just gonna do it anyways. Yeah I'm going to do it but it's dark so I don't know if it's gonna come out nice but if it's not gonna come out nice I'll just do another one in the morning. Wi-Fi at the house was really bad so we had to come to the MTN office to pick up a SIM card because MTN is actually really good in Ghana so that's what we're doing here. So guys we're currently at this place called SIMA. Hmm? What's she going to get? I don't know bro. And Kika is getting waxed. <laughs> you don't look that great. Mm -hmm. there braiding her hair honestly next time i come to ghana i'm definitely going to braid my hair because that baby was so fast and she did such a great job hi guys today is officially day two in ghana kia's birthday that's if you don't know we're here for her birthday in ghana for a couple of days so basically i didn't vlog much yesterday after kia needed to get waxed <laughs> which flopped and we have to pick um, a couple of our other friends at the airport 
then we got back and we had dinner <laughs> we had dinner and yeah literally we we're just like just having conversations like just chilling and um drinking and just vibing till it was our birthday obviously we wished happy birthday and we like so like vibing and all we slept by like 2 a.m that's night but yeah nothing major really happened but today we're going to have like a barbecue party in the house then go for dinner later that's the birthday girl <laughs> Nine on one, shall be drive, look alive, look alive. Niggas came up on this side, now they on the other side. Oh well, fuck them dog, we gon' see how hard they ride. I get racks to go outside, and I split it with the guy. We up on the other side, niggas acting like we tied. I've been gone since like July, niggas acting like I died. They won't be expecting shit when Capo go to slide. Cause I told them that we put that shit behind us, but I lied. Hey, hey, look who I'm around, man. If I fucked up, I'ma beat downtown, man. Folk Slow down, man. That's if I get caught, man. Push me to the end, so it really ain't my motherfucking fault, man. I'm not to blame, man. The fucking industry is cut, though. I'm not the same, man. And I can let you check the tag. Now I'm rocking name brand. I'm only chasing at the bags. Now I got a game plan. And I'm out here with the 700, 3 out 5s. Look alive, look alive. Niggas came up on this side. Now they on the other side. Oh, well, fuck them, dog. We gon' see how hard they ride. I get racks to go outside, and I spit it with the guys. We up on the other side. Niggas acting like we tied. I've been gone since like July. Niggas acting like I died. They won't be expecting shit when Capo go to slide. Cause I told them that we put that shit behind. fun went out for dinner at San, a place called Santoko then went to a mood bar a lounge called mood bar just chilled there the vibe was nice no school vibes nothing too serious and we're out till late so, so hence so i'm just waking up but anyways i'm on vacation ain't nobody care about that later was just like trying to like rest and all but today's like chilled we might go out i don't know you guys will see that if i do hopefully i will get some more and that's what like i needed to come in here to just see a couple of things and yeah Checking in again with you guys. Basically, all we just did was sleep, to be honest. But now we're gonna have for dinner at some place called Bistro, so that should be fun. Anyways, um, got my cute top. Got it from Fashion Tribe. So we're ready 
So we got here and it's closed. So we're doing shots. Obviously, you guys saw our plan to go quad biking flop, so we started to go fabric shopping and just do some sightseeing. That's how we really spent our Friday afternoon. I'm not joking. Um, we're having a mini barbecue thingy today, just something chilled and relaxed. Nobody's doing too much because we have a flight to catch tomorrow. Oh, whose light is that? Final day in Ghana. Oh, it was such a lovely one. I had a great time. This is the end of my vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully, you enjoyed it because I feel like it was like a bit of a bumpy ride for me but i mean it's my first time so don't judge me but definitely the next one will be better than this so ghana was nice i'll be back definitely so bye